Emergency poo, code brown. There's a fish called a butterfish. We discovered it at a fish market one time. It's also called white tuna. Took it home, put salt and pepper on it, put it on the grill. It was phenomenal. It was really, really good fish. Didn't need any sauce or anything. I gotta find out about this fish. So I did a little bit of research and all this stuff came up about don't eat too much butterfish because it has this oil inside that you can't, your body can't digest. And these people had horror stories of like, I was shopping and you know, this oil started coming out of me and blah, blah, blah. Like and I was like, oh, whatever. No, not a laxative. It's like that? No. It's like anal leakage. The oil. Oh, it just comes out. It just oh, comes no. out. Okay. Oh, so no. <laughs> I didn't think much of it. I had a laugh and I forgot all about it. Now, fast forward about two years was the next time I saw butterfish. Hey, they have butterfish. Let's get some butterfish. Grilled it up just like last time. Ate it. Now, my wife was not hungry. I was like, I'll eat yours then. Woke up the next morning. Went to the bathroom. It felt like I took a number three in the toilet. And I was like, oh, that's kind of weird because I didn't feel funny or anything. And I looked in the toilet. It looked like pepperoni pizza grease. Ew. You know, like the pepperoni, yes, like it's on top of the water. Yes, like orange oil was floating mm. in the toilet and it smelled fishy. And yeah, I was like, yeah, oh yeah. God. Uh, I was no. like, and then it dawned on me and I was like, it's the butterfish. And I laughed actually. I was like, the butterfish got me. But who cares? It was in the toilet. Yeah, right? Yeah, right. So no big deal. Right. So um, mm -hmm. I went about my business. I, I was on the computer, just playing around on the computer and stuff. And I started smelling the fishy smell again. And I was no. like, I was like, what? And I stood up and the cushion that I was sitting on was oh, wet. Soaked it up. It was soaked was it, uh... with this oil. And I, had, it, I didn't even feel it come out of me. No way. It was everywhere. My shorts, oh, uh, my underwear, just, everything. I was like, oh my God, oh my God. So I just picked everything up and I threw it in the washing machine. I changed my clothes and I went out on my porch. And it happened again. Oh. It's the same temperature as your body. So you don't even feel it coming out of you. Yeah, how do you not feel the wetness? Actually, I smelled it before I felt the wetness. Oh, yeah. God. Oh. Um, okay, it's gross, I know. What I had to do for the rest of the day was I wadded up paper towels and I shoved them between my <laughs> ass cheeks oh my to catch God. any more oil. <laughs> Even through putting those clothes through the washing machine multiple times, it never came out. It still smelled like fish. Ew. And I had to throw that all those disgusting. clothes out. It's oh, disgusting. Wow. It's disgusting. That disgusting. <laughs> That's a butterfish That's warning. That's the grossest poop story. Yeah. It yeah. may not be funny to some people. <laughs> <laughs>